Ashi for her, which I will be gifting her on a Valentine's Day. Here I have used felt paper, few beads, and charms over here to make it look gorgeous. This is totally hand stitched in both the plushie. I have used a, a needle and thread and used the stitching all by hand. So this was more of a homework and this one is more for the tutorial. So here I have added a small tag as well. Are the small charms which has added some more uh, detailing to this heart plushie so without any further delay let me show you what all things I need for today's tutorial for today's project the very first thing which I will be needing is a felt paper this is more of a creamish one uh, and it's not fully white in color and then I have got this template. This is a heart template. And while I made this one, I realized that I should be making something a little bigger than this one. That's the reason why I have chosen this template. Though this heart, while I cut it out, it was purely a hand cut out one. Uh, I will be giving the measurement of this heart template wh uh, while I start making the project. Then I have gathered here few of my circle cutouts. I have actually got three circle uh, cutouts. These are my die cutouts. And this measures Uh, four centimeter in diameter three of these are of same size here I have got two vine beads these are actually my favorite ones again here I have got some uh, die cut out flowers I have chosen two different colors so I, I can be layering it nicely. This is a ribbon, a piece of ribbon actually, which measures almost 8 cm in length. This one uh, is a paper tag. Uh, this is a die cut out tag. This is just for decoration so it is totally optional. Here I have got some beads and some charms. Since it is Valentine's and I am making a heart plushie so I decided to take a key charm over here. And this is another charm which is written over here, handmade. This is again another bead. I like this bead because it has some nice embossing work done in it. These are my two pearl ones, pearl beads. And here are my uh, three metallic bits. But I am not sure which one will I be using. So I have taken few of them. And as the tutorial progresses, I will be deciding upon which one to use. And this one is a clasp ball keychain. Then comes my scissor and needle and thread. Handful of fiber fill and last but not the least hot glue gun. So these are pretty much my supplies for today's tutorial. So without any further delay let's begin first thing first uh, let me measure the length of this heart so I will be measuring the vertical uh, length first um, so 
so here it is actually coming to this point so it is almost 12 centimeter vertically and then horizontally it is actually coming to this point so it is almost 16 centimeter uh, horizontally so this uh, is pretty much the measurement now taking my felt paper I will be tracing this half shape Tracing is done. Now I will be using my scissors to cut it off. One is done. The other one also I will be needing. joining together I will just see the extra sides and I will be cutting it off I can see some extras over here so that I need to trim it off since now my both heart cutouts are ready I will be drawing a freehand heart shape in one of these heart shape cutouts like I did in this one so for which I have actually taken a paper template which is actually the size of this half shape cutout. I will be folding this one in half and cutting out Now with the help of my pencil, I will be drawing a border. Then moving on to the next level, here I have got, uh, actually I have got three uh, circle die cutouts. With one I have uh, already made one uh, rose. And the other two are left which will be I will be following the same and making rows in the other two as well so for making that I will be making a spiral shape like this I will be cutting it So that my end is secured.
something blue at this point to secure it at the base. So my three flowers are ready. So with the same diameter, uh, I have made uh, three flowers of different size. So it is absolutely uh, on you how you want to make your flowers look like. I will be attaching the leaves and the flowers So my decoration is done, now comes the stitching part, but before uh, moving on to the stitching part, I will be gluing this portion from inside a little bit on two, three sides so that the two parts stick together and they don't move. some more fiber fill inside the plushie here I have attached this ends with glue almost come to the end part and whatever fiber fill I had to add I have already added and I haven't added anymore now my stitching has been done and I can see uh, some portion here is necessary to be trimmed off of my scissors I will be trimming a bit to make both the sides even. This is looking more perfect to me. So now I will be taking my piece of ribbon which happens to be 8 cm in length but I am sure I will not be needing this long so I need to I will be folding it in half and I will be trimming a bit. I will be attaching both the ends with my hot glue. 